in this video i'm going to make a full width video background section using thrive architect um, this uh, this is the thrive theme builder header and this is the this footer is also from the thrive theme builder so this is not a landing page template but a default default page template from uh, thrive theme builder and uh, so and to do this i'm going to follow this blog post i'm going to follow the different steps in this blog post to make the video video background section so i do not make any mistakes or miss anything out so this these are the different steps in this blog post so let's get started so the first step is to create a new page and launch thrive architect okay so let me create a new page And let me give this page a name Thrive Video Background. Okay, now let me just save this page as a draft and just launch Thrive Architect. Okay, so what I'm going to do, let's see what I'm going to do next. Hide the top and bottom section in order to make the video back, uh, background video stand out. So uh, this, this is the top section, the, the one section with the title and uh, this is the bottom section, the call to action, uh, the call to action section. So, but I want my uh, video background to be just like this, full width, full width and there will be no top section. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to remove this one and this one using the Thrive Theme Builder option. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to click over here on the page and then go to the visibility settings and then under the top section, I'm going to hide it and also under the bottom section, I'm going to hide this one too. Okay, so let me see the next step. Oh, then I'm going to add a background section. Then I'm going to stretch the background section so that it covers the full width of the screen, full width of the screen. And then I'm going to add a minus 40 pixels uh, top margin so that the uh, gap between the top section and the header is removed. So let me show you what does this mean. Actually. So let me add the background section. Okay, so after adding this background section, let me choose this one. And I'm going to, so you can see one thing that this background does not cover the entire screen width. So it only covers this, this part, the content area. So I need to cover it full, I need to make it uh, cover the full width just like this one. So let me go over here and I'm going to stretch to fit the screen. See, there is a gap between the header and the background section. There is a small gap. So to remove that top uh, gap, I'm going to add a minus 40 pixel uh, margin at the top of the background section. So that will remove this gap. Okay, so the gap is removed. And now let me see what I'm going to do. Okay, so now I'm just simply going to, I'm going to use this video. This is a free stock image video. Let me just reload it to make sure. So this is a free stock video for five minutes long. So I'm going to copy its URL, copy video URL. Then I'm going to select this background section, main option, not at not at the main channel. Under the background style, after you select the background section, then go click the background style and then turn the video background on. And then, so this is a YouTube video, right? So this is a YouTube video. And I'm going to select the source as YouTube video. I'm going to paste the link of the video I have copied. And I'm going to hit enter. So now it will show this uh, 
background video start showing without any issues and you can see that uh, it is full width uh, but it is, is still small so it is still kind of narrow so what I'm going to do I'm going to go to the main section and I'm going to set the section minimum height to 500 pixels okay so now it covers the full width and 500 pixel height so let's see what's the next step add a dark overlay and text to the background video so now I need to uh, what I need to do is now I need to darken this video background and I need to add this text over here so let me just to dark uh, to make this uh, to add a dark overlay to this video background just go to background style click here and click over here this will add a dark overlay and this is a 50% overlay, overlay dark overlay I can increase this 85% or I can even decrease this to 25% so I think 50% uh, is good enough good enough uh, otherwise the text won't be so clear so now I'm going to add the text okay so I'm going to add this text in, inside the background section so the text uh, text is over here so I'm going to click the text and just remove the extra spacing under the text and I'm going to turn it white and make it uppercase and then I'm going to click the background section and then I am going to I'm going to align it vertically center and then go to typography and center align horizontally okay so now let me like customize the text a bit so I'm uh, I'm going to use the font Montserrat M O N T Montserrat this is the font I'm going to use uh, this is my favorite font so and I'm going to increase the font size to 65 so it's big enough and looks nice so so this is done so this now looks exactly like this one this done okay so let me just save it and uh, let me just quickly test the uh, tablet and mobile versions I can just uh, decrease it a little bit in the mobile okay like this I can also decrease the background image sorry background video height in mobile in uh, laptop or desktop it will be the same okay so this is the thing so this is how create a nice background section uh, using Thrive Architect so another thing I'd like to show that another thing I'd like to show that uh, you can only set a video background for background sections you cannot set a big video background for like content boxes for example this is a content box so when I go to the background style I will, I will not see a, a set a video background option but when I uh, add a background section when I add a background section it looks like uh, kind of like uh, the content box but it is not a content box it is a background section so in the background section I will get the option to add a video background but not in the content box under the background style so this is how you create a nice video background section using Thrive Architect and uh, if you want to read this blog post so in case in case you are having an issue like uh, following this video you can also read this blog post you can also read this blog post where I've written down everything step by step you can follow this blog post in, instead I'm uh, including the link of this blog post down in the description below so please uh, have, a, have a look if you have the time and uh, if you like this video if you found this video useful uh, then please subscribe like my video and subscribe to my channel thank you and have a great day